Okay, I'm going to show you how to do custom grip. So if you have um, a grip that is coming from the parting line, let's say the parting line is right here in the middle, um, and it's just coming straight out um, the front, but it's not wrapping around the, the top. Or uh, let's say it's flush on the bottom and coming up on the top. Yeah, some of you guys have ones where it's just up on the front and then it doesn't go wrap around the top at all. Um, I'm realizing now this is, so I'm going to show you two different ways. <laughs> One is it's just coming up here and then it's not um, wrapping around. And I'll show you how to do it if it's wrapping around. Sorry. Um, I'm trying to get this done tonight. Let's see, cut this. I'm going to trim. I've got this here. Um, it's gonna, This one's going to go right to the bottom, and you'll see. And then this, um, let's offset this sketch in a little bit. Point four. Make it more. There. Why not? Okay. So I'm going to trim offset that. So I made all of these perpendicular to this bottom line so that it would curve around with it. Um, and then just one of these lines is perpendicular. And then the, these are parallel, each one, uh, to just the uh, one that's perpendicular. So this one's perpendicular and this is parallel to this. That way it kind of fans out. Anyway, got to do it right for the demo. Okay. Okay. So now I've got this. Um, this is just for a demo, so I didn't measure this out, but no, no. Did I not mean that? Okay, whatever. All right, I'm going to leave that. So now, before I extrude, before I do anything, I'm going to surface. <sighs> offset surface. I'll show you both ways. Okay, offset surface, we'll do 0.5. Okay, so then we're going to hide this. And now, feature, I click on the sketch first. Feature, extrude. Oh shit, I never checked that. I wasn't paying attention. So I did on this plane. It's fine. Um, I'll show you what to do. Up to body. We're going to merge. And then, like, if you did what I did and did the wrong side, it really doesn't matter because you can roll up here, edit feature, and it will be before, be before that all happened. <laughs> So I can, probably don't need that bottom part, just do this. <clears throat> okay, and then I can show this surface, cut with surface, and then make sure it's pointing that way. So it's cutting those features. But yeah, so you want your plane to be out here, wherever, so it's going in. So that's how you do that. So see, and then you can have fillet. So if you have texture or grip where it's, you can tell that they made it so it's flush here, that's a way to do it. And you can add a nice fillet um, from where that parting line was. And then I'll show you now how to do it if it's wrapping around the whole thing, which is a different deal. Um, Okay, so first thing we're going to do is offset the surface whoops, all the way around.
Okay. It's offsetting the offset. <laughs> Hang on. Delete. Yes. Delete body. We don't need this anymore. Okay, let's try this again. Offset. There we go. Perfect. So if you've got grip that rolls all the way around, um, I'm going to keep this pretty straightforward. Okay, let's say you've got a grip that's doing this. This isn't going to be pretty. This is just to show you how to do it. And you can get as crazy as you want with all the grip, right? Like it could fan out, could do all, it could be like closer and then get spread out further. Um, So this is going to be like a part, I don't know what this is, you'll see. I don't know what this is. Might be weird, we're just going to leave it. Okay, so these are going to be bigger, 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 bigger. Okay, so now we're going to split line. We're going to select all these surfaces that are offset. Got it. If you click OK. All right, so now that wraps around. Then we are going to delete face. Everything that we don't want because we're going to thicken everything. So, this is like if you're looking at your object that you're replicating and the party lines aren't ish, like you don't have draft, you have to worry about draft for any of the sides, it's like it's all good. So way to do it. This side's building in for draft. I mean, this side would work too, but whatever your needs are. All right, delete. And then we're going to thicken. do it this way. I always do um, uh, extrudes.
see if I get something with that. Now it's all one surface and you can see how you can get textures that way. Okay, hope that was helpful. You can so you can do the same thing for going in, but you're gonna do a thick and cut. You're gonna offset it in and then do thick and cut. That makes sense. You're going to do just like we did here. You're going to have a surface that's up on the inside and you can select it over in your tree. And then you can, or you can do extrude cut. Same processes for this that's in my channel. Okay, hope that helps guys. I'm done.